Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Destiny. YBJ Destiny. N is for YBJ. T is for Destiny. And that's how I got my business name, ND Fashion. So please subscribe and like my channel. So in this video, I will be teaching us the easier way to cut a senator top. This is the fabric I will be using. And let's proceed at all. So I will be taking out a little inches for the top on the top of the fabric and measure my full length. And the full length is 38 inches. 38 inches. I mark now. So I will be adding. 5 inches extra, 38 inches, 5 inches, don't forget, and mind you this is the back side I'm cutting, because I'll be adding a little design to the back, and the design, most people call it fishing, so I'll be using that word, fishing, so I will make a straight line now. line is out so now for the fishing I'll be taking out two inches remember it's for the back so before bringing out all these measurements my chest is 39 so I divide into four and I make my folding Mind you, the chest will determine the length or the size of the fabric you will be using. You will be folding out. So as you can see, I fold exactly what I will be using for the chest. If you like, you can still add more allowance to it or inches to get your slit. So let's proceed. Now is out the back is out because I, if, if i will proceed to the main cotton i will first of all bring uh, take out the back and take my front as well so i'm trimming the back side now it's almost out the full cotton or the senior total comes the front and the back so this is the front and I will also reduce a little inches to the top like I did on the back and I will be taking my full length my full length which includes the five inches which includes the 5 inches, 38, adding the 5 inches. So I will deduct 3.5 inches, 3.5 inches from the front, of which it makes it, it makes the back more longer or taller than the front. 3.5 inches. So the length has reduced. Now I will be lining and I will be shaping at the same time. All right, I've made a line. So I will now get the chest with my two inches allowance that I've already added to the chest. Two inches allowance. Remember, the chest is thirty-nine. So, if the chest is thirty-nine, we are dividing into four, like I said earlier. So, thirty-nine divide. You are having nineteen and a half. And if you divide nineteen and a half, you will be getting nine half to quarter. So, you add your two inches. 
to it. So you must treat because that's the chest. Like I said, if you want to add more inches for your slit, you can. The shape is at now, so I will be making my trimming. I'll be cutting straight, just like that. You can drop your comment if you need any more explanations. So the back is how this is the back now. The two inches I I I dotted, I marked out for my fishing. So I'll be holding it straight with my iron. iron is and the iron is out, as you can see. So I'll be placing my front together with the back. So if you can see very well now, the front is now short and the back is more longer now. So it's out as you can see is now taller than the front so i'll be taking my shoulder down which is the slant we all know call it shoulder down three inches three inches shoulder down so i will mark and i will shape as well to the edge as you can see i've done my shaping Mind you, this is the side that is opening. As in, is the part that you can easily open with message uh, a senator. Now I will take the front down. Just like you can see there now. And make sure they are all equal on the edges. Just like that. So I will be taking half inches for my overlapping because the back will overlap the front half inches the reason of checking it is to get the straight line you can't be able to do it do it the same way i'm doing it now so i marked straight for my overlapping the half inches is for your sewing don't forget that the half inches is for your sewing so you iron Straight, make sure it's on the line. Alright, I've done my ironing, and as you can see, half inch is there. So, I will not be dividing the ball because I've already gotten the shape or, or the measurement of the chest. Alright, now the shoulder is 19. So, dividing 19, you're having nine and a half inches I'll be adding half inches to the, to the length of it or the shoulder now what your shoulder gives you is what you put down to your armhole and which is the nine so the nine you still take it down to your armhole that's the that's my boss now the nine you take it down to the armhole so that you can be able to have a nice slant shape i don't have my ruler my curve ruler so i'll be using a straight one but mind you it will also come out slant yes it will also be on a shape form just like i'm doing it now if you don't have your ruler do it the same way out now the shape is out so i'll be trimming because i want you to get the shape i'm talking about i don't have my ruler but it's okay now sorry about that as you can see it's out so the boss uh, or, the, or the chest rather is already out so i won't be bothering about that anymore unless you want to add uh, your slit you can extend the measurement like I said earlier so now my neck is 16 so I'll be taking down two and a half inches from the overlapping where the uh, the back overlapped I'll be taking in the depth now 
two inches so i dotted two uh, half inches from the the neck length so i'll be joining it together with the same shape just like the arm hole is as you can see i don't have my ruler like i said earlier but it's okay now so i won't be measuring because i know it's okay for me you can still measure yours if you are not satisfied because i'm putting your tape around and my back will complete the measurement the back will complete the measurement in my next video i will lecture you or update you on the neck cutting so this is it i will iron now but i won't be able i won't force the iron so that i cannot remove the mark you can see there the straight mark which is the slant mark and that is where i'm getting my back from i, I took out half inches but before cutting the front i've already notched the back as well because the overlapping makes me to notch it so i can be able to get the line i'll be needing or the size of the neck in my next video i will give you a proper way to do it is that now i'll give you any the shape so if you put it together then i call of which i'm getting my 16 inches please like and subscribe to my channel and wait for more videos this is the senator cotton senator top cotton for men you trim out the extra allowance there the waist that now why i didn't add any uh, inches to the slit is because i will be using i will be using a designer fabric to turn the inside which is the material we see inside most of our senators so this is the cotton subscribe to my channel thank you very much see you in my next video